hey, so update, I went ahead and purchased a new chair. Um, I just got tired of waiting and don't I don't want to deal with the uh, gaming chair thing anymore. Um, so I just went ahead and went with a reputable company. Um, and uh, this chair met all of the requirements that I had for it, being that, one, it supports well over 300 pounds weight capacity. Uh, and two, it's comfy. Uh, I sat in it in the store, and it I came away pretty impressed. <laughs> Has good butt feel. <laughs> um, I also checked some reviews online to see how, if it, what people thought of this, and th this chair came highly recommended. So, what I'm going to do is get it together. Um, it does have some assembly. We'll get this together. We'll compare this to the AK Racing Chair, and hopefully, uh, hopefully, some folks that watch this video can come away a little bit better informed uh, before they make a make a purchase. Because both this and the AK Racing Chair occupy the same price bracket. Um, you know, this this chair is on sale for three thirty right now, but normally retails for three ninety nine. Um, and that's actually on sale in and of itself. Uh, and the AK Racing Chair was four hundred dollars. So, you know, we'll 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 see how long this chair or uh, how well this chair does over a long stretch of time. Maybe I'll do an update video once I've used it for a couple of months to a year. But um, for now, let's just get this chair together, do a quick comparison, and maybe we'll detail. Uh, what broke and why this that shouldn't happen here with this guy all right let's get started okay so that was pretty easy um, took me about 20 25 minutes to uh, get this chair together instructions were easy to follow um, already sat in it can confirm still comfy um, but uh, yeah let's turn our attention to this guy here for a moment because I want to talk about what I believe failed on this chair and uh, why I don't think this one will um, and also some of the things that I liked about this thing so um, this chair is held together by uh, these two pieces uh, that's just like a dummy hinge and uh, this guy here which controls the forward and back motion of the chair uh, it is secured by these points right here. Um, as you can clearly see, this is completely bent out of shape. And if I flip this around, it's totally level on this side. So all of the weight was being put on this one side, um, which bent the actual metal frame of the chair itself. Uh, and the reason I don't think that's gonna happen to this guy over here is because if I flip this around, you can see that there's a metal bar that goes up and down the back of the chair and then goes under and is secured to a uh, metal plate which is sandwiched between uh, thick plywood boards um, that run through the entire length of the seat. So the way it's being dispersed across the uh, seat itself rather than on a hinge. Um, so some of the things that uh, I liked about this chair that I'm going to miss. Um, the arms were really nice. Uh, they could go pretty low. Uh, and you could get them out of the way for things like if you were um, doing some VR or playing like rhythm games like Guitar Hero, Rock Band, etc. Uh, that was really nice. Really nice to have. Um, being able to lay flat on the chair was pretty nice. Uh, I don't think it's required. I'm definitely not gonna not gonna be missing it too much, but it was a nice feature. And lastly, the uh, base and the casters, super nice. These these casters were really quiet, really smooth, handled pretty much any material I threw at it, no problem. Uh, I might actually try and get that thing off there and put it on this one, um, see if it works. Uh, just because it was it was super nice. Um, might look a little weird, but. Huh. But, uh, yeah, it was super nice. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of that's kind of everything. It's a bit of a bummer that this failed, but I'm glad uh, glad that I ended up with this guy here. Um, just say so, FYI, I got it from Office Max. It was uh, 339 I think I said that before, but just a reminder. Um, 
look forward to a review a review slash impressions of this vid, of this chair in 10 months to a year i guess <laughs> hopefully it hasn't broken uh but if it does the uh, warranty covers it this time uh, i don't know what i'm gonna do with this chair um 